you forgot that by migrating your activity from working a job and working on your own that you had now put every single thing into one basket. Yes. <laughs> employer, employee, health insurance, and every single thing that you can think about, mm. you put into one basket and then you got frustrated. Now, one of the most amazing things that happened in this room this morning is that God showed up. Yes. Amen. 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 I'm a little upset that he did. <laughs> I'm going to tell you why. Because now, there are no excuses. Mm. Because today is the first day of the rest of your life. Amen. Hello. So all of the behavior and activity that you practice, drill and rehearse, whether you got out of bed late, or refused to get it because you felt so broke, busted, disgusted, you didn't have any clients, mm. so you decided it ain't even worth it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So the person in your life who's going out working, coming home, wondering why you ain't moved yet. I'm trying to mix up British English and American slang, okay? <laughs> <laughs> why you were at home, sitting around, doing nothing, and then, you know what the worst thing in the world is? Silent communication. Mm, that's true. Hi, honey, how you doing? I didn't hear you because you're not doing anything. There's a second buzz that comes through, and it's an internal buzz that you don't see, but it's inside your brain, and it's going like this. You're stupid. You're an idiot. You're arrogant. Self-taught negatively, and you're wondering why you aren't moving. Oh. Then the enzymes in your body begin to participate in the process. Oh, my chest hurts. My chest hurts. I don't feel so good today. My leg, oh, my, my stomach. Because your body is getting frustrated. You see, when God showed up, he became the first dream builder. And he began with an idea just like you do. There is nothing that you are doing that's different than what God did. Hello. Nothing. The only thing that you're doing is exercising your right as a procreator in the process. Mm. All right. Did you hear me? Yes. Okay. And I'm not thinking about preaching today. I'm just talking. <laughs> I'm talking with you because God yes. showed up. Amen. I was yes. going to go basic. And God showed up and I said, you know what? Let me give it to them. All right. Come on. Because it's your fault that you failed because you were developed as the primary successful object in the universe. Mm -hmm. As a matter of fact, when you don't move, creation suffers. The gentleman had the nerve to say something earlier. It got me really excited. He said, women? Hmm. I'm excited about women. Oh, yeah. Not because I love women, but I do. I love them internally and externally. I love how your mind moves, how your spirit moves, how your body moves. It's the chemistry. It's the one thing the creation enjoys having participated in existence daily. The movement of women. You see, because without you, I could not be birthed. And that's why I dedicate what we started in Barbados at the first women's conference where Sabrina spoke as part of the process. So today I want to say to you, and I want to tell you some basic things relevant to this situation. Now, when you look around, you feel hopeless and you don't participate in the process. I participate in the process of caring about you with passion. Sometimes people think I get angry when I get so passionate. But it's because I care, to re the, I care enough to render the very best. And that's why I'm participating with the CNBC. Qualify your market share. Qualify your market share. You start this idea, step one. Understand that you are the first product. Invest in you. If anything is going to change, it has to start in your mind. You have to practice, drill, and rehearse the asset called your brain. Otherwise, you will become a liability to your productive process. Hello? Hello? 